is Jose Trujillo. I'm a fine art artist. I'm coming to you from my art studio to talk to art collectors. I got some tips and advice for art collectors, okay? Uh, this one's about, let's say that you have a, a, a valuable painting, okay? Or a, a sculpture, whatever. I'm going to talk about paintings because I, I, I paint. I'm a painter. You have a valuable painting uh, and something valuable, whatever valuable is to you. Maybe it's from a famous artist or semi-famous artist or, or you just love the painting. If you love it so much, be very careful if you need restoring. Let's say something happened, I don't know, a scratch or, or, or it's fading or it's cracking or whatever. Um, some of you might be tempted to just contact any artist. <laughs> I'm saying this because I've had some people contact me before and say, can you restore this painting? Can you retouch it? Be very careful with that because uh, most artists, certainly I don't, I, don't, I don't like doing that, I don't do that, but most artists are going to say, not most artists, but most artists that need, uh, that, that may need the money or want to be, want to, don't, don't know how to say no, I guess. Uh, might say, yeah, sure, I'll take care of it for you. And you might, you might be getting, uh, <laughs> you might be having a surprise there. Uh, take it to a professional restorer. Don't just give it to an artist because many times artists, especially because artists have different, they have different medias. Even if they do oil paint, they might not do, might not understand how to restore. Of course they don't understand. They're not restorers or they don't, uh, have the, the proper technique that the other artist in the painting was using or you know whatever you don't want to turn into it, it you know you don't want it to uh to completely mess up your your art piece just because you didn't take it to someone who was professional you know at doing that and i know you might you might be thinking well it's so costly to take it to someone else it might be but you're saving the art piece you're not you're not uh just having a a band-aid on it you know put a put on it if you are um, let's say that the artist does acrylic and the artist is not maybe professional enough to say you know what I don't know what this painting was or or how to test what the painting was created on or 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 uh, or the painting has like these huge thick layers of of varnish you know <laughs> and and the artist is trying to put uh, acrylic paint on it and you know all these things that just are not going to give it are not going to do a uh, right to the painting. Uh, my advice to you is, is don't mess with any of that. Don't give it to just um, any artist. Don't give it to artists. Give it to a professional restorer. There's plenty out there. All you have to do is talk to framers. Talk to framers or talk to gallery owners and they'll refer you to a professional uh, restorer. That's the best way to do it so that you can take care of your artwork. My name is Jose Trujillo. I'm a fine art artist. Thank you so much for watching.